Hi everybody, my name is Diana and welcome to Sweet Isalado. In this video, we're gonna make corn dogs. We've been making a few healthy recipes and I think we need to change it up a little bit. As always, the link for this recipe can be found at the end of the video in the info box below and at sweetisalado.com. First, we're gonna heat our oil. I'm using vegetable oil. We're gonna place it in a large pan and we're gonna bring it up to 350 degrees. In the meantime, we're gonna make our batter. So we're gonna need some milk. We're gonna add an egg and we're gonna whisk it. Now we're gonna mix our dry ingredients. So in a large bowl, we're gonna add some flour, cornmeal, sugar, baking powder, and salt. We're also gonna whisk this really well. And then we're gonna add our wet ingredients into our dry. Once it's nice and smooth, we're gonna pour it into a glass and this is gonna make it easier for us to use. So here we have the hot dogs that we're gonna use and we're gonna dry them really well. I use a paper towel for this and this is to help the batter stick to our hot dogs. Some people like to dredge them in flour but I don't think that's necessary. These are the wooden skewers that we're gonna use and we're going to insert them through the hot dog starting at one end and stopping right before it reaches the other end. And we're gonna do that with every single hot dog. Then we're carefully gonna dip our hot dogs into the batter, making sure everything's well covered. And if you find that your batter is too thick, you can thin it out with just a little bit of milk. Now we're gonna fry our hot dogs in our preheated oil for about three to five minutes, making sure we turn them over so that they don't burn. We're gonna fry them until they're golden brown, and we're also gonna fry them in batches of about two to three hot dogs, and that way the temperature of our oil doesn't go down. Once they're ready, we're gonna take them out of the oil. We're also gonna drain them on paper towels and let them cool a little bit before serving. You can also serve them with some mustard and ketchup. And that's your recipe for making delicious corn dogs. If you enjoyed this recipe and this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and if you haven't done so already, subscribe to this channel so you can be up to date with all of the new videos that I upload in the future. And don't forget that you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, and Google+. Thanks everybody for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye and buen provecho.